welcome back. <laughs> so, uh, Jeffrey, since we had so much fun last time, I thought it would be really fun to read another story from Oink and Pearl. What do you think? Yeah, me, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, this is from Oink and Pearl, and the next story is called... Yeah. That's right. It's called Fish. <laughs> One hot day, Pearl found Oink in the tool shed. He was dusting an old fishing pole. Look what I found, he squealed. We can take the rowboat and catch a pile of fish. No way, said Pearl. Oink picked up the fishing pole and headed for the pond. Wait, called Pearl. You need worms for bait. Do I, said Oink. Of course said Pearl. So they dug for worms. Oink watched them wiggle in the can. They are nice, he said. Ugh, said Pearl. The rowboat was tied to a tree. Oink pulled at the rope. It's stuck, he cried. Once my jump rope got like this, said Pearl. She worked and worked until the rope came loose. Hop in, she said. They rowed to the middle of the pond. Oink dropped his fishing line into the water. Oink, Pearl said, you forgot the bait. Oink looked at the worms. Do we have to, he asked. I will do it, said Pearl. Oink closed his eyes while Pearl put a worm on the hook. They sat a long time with the line in the water. They sat and sat. The sun grew hotter and hotter. This is fun, said Oink. It is very boring, said Pearl. Suddenly, Oink felt something tug at his hook. He pulled his line. A huge fish wiggled and twisted on it. Look, Pearl, Oink cried. I caught a fish. Now what do I do? Hang tight, yelled Pearl. She pulled the fish into the boat. Oink stared at it. He had never seen a fish so close. His eyes are meaner than a snake's eyes, he whispered. His teeth are sharper than Papa's saw. His mouth is bigger than Mama's spaghetti pot. Oink backed away so fast that he rocked the boat. It tipped left, then it tipped right. Watch out, cried Pearl. She caught Oink just in time. The fish jumped off the hook and back into the water. Goodbye, fish whispered Oink. Oink and Pearl watched the fish swim away. Now the water was as smooth as a green mirror. I caught a fish, said Oink. I caught you, said Pearl. Oink watched his face and Pearl's face on the mirror of green water. I really caught a fish, he whispered. The end. Did you like that, Jeffrey? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I did too. Well, there are many more stories in this book, so we'll read another one the next time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you all for joining me, and I'll see you again. Bye now. Yeah.